oh, like, is this me? It can start making you feel insecure. So hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a really exciting video for you all. Uh, it's not that exciting, but basically I just want to have a chat slash rant with you about why I don't wear as much makeup anymore. Obviously I still wear makeup, I still do makeup, but nowhere near as much. I used to be 100%, no, 90% makeup now I'm probably 20% doing makeup, and that is a big jump, especially for someone that loves makeup and loves doing makeup. And I have a few reasons for it, and... I thought I'd address them because people keep and keep asking me, some nicely, some in very rude ways. So yeah, this is not like a normal video, I do, if you're new then I promise I do normal videos all the time, beauty and fashion, so hit the subscribe button down below if you want to and give it a big thumbs up and yeah let's just get started. Holy. Okay, the bed keeps shaking and I'm not 100% sure why, is it shaking or is that just me? It is shaking, hang on. Uh, okay, I'm gonna be very angry. All right, we're all good, we're all good. Stop. Okay, so I just wanna start off with a simple fact. I did not, before the comments are like, so you basically wore makeup because you were self-conscious. No, that's not why I originally started wearing makeup, originally, that important word here, originally. I did not originally, so I've been literally doing makeup since I was eight years old, and obviously I didn't <laughs> have anything to like cover up when I was eight because I was eight, and um, I had nice freckles. Not anymore. <laughs> I am wearing a tiny bit still on my cheeks. Not gonna lie, my skin isn't this good. But um, yeah, so I didn't wear makeup originally because I was insecure. I feel like though, it in a way makeup can after you wear it for years and years and years, it can start making you feel insecure about yourself, about how you feel and look without makeup so when you take it off at night it's like oh like is this me <laughs> is this me or is the, why am i so ugly without makeup etc and i feel like i got into that kind of trap and by the way there's tons of different reason, reasons this is just one of them like a main not a main reason but like one of the reasons and i kind of got into a trap where i was just like oh like i don't want to take my makeup off i was just like no like, I just look so ugly and disgusting without makeup on. And, obviously, I, I'm not. Because <laughs> I'm not ugly and disgusting. I'm not saying I'm the prettiest, but I'm saying not the ugliest. And no one is ugly at all. So don't ever think that, by the way. And, um, I was just like, I don't ever want to take my makeup off. And that is not a good way to be. That's not a reason why you should ever wear makeup. And that's why I started to wear makeup obviously not eye makeup we're going to talk about eye makeup being a completely different thing that's completely different because i obviously you don't do eye makeup because it's insecure but i mean i'm talking more about like my face makeup and stuff like that and i used to just insecure about how my eyebrows look without makeup how even my eyelashes look without eyelashes on or my eyes look without eyeliner and it was mainly the skin makeup and i was like i just don't want to take this off like i look like a like a, a, a foot like a toe and I just didn't want to be like that. I wanted to feel confident. I, I am a very confident person and I just wanted to be confident without makeup. So that is one of the reasons why I have stopped wearing it a huge, huge amount because I needed to learn how to love myself and feel pretty without wearing makeup. And you should too. <laughs> Inspirational, no, I'm joking. That is my first point. My next point, um, okay, that was probably the main point, but also I just haven't been in love with makeup as much i don't know what it is i always love doing makeup i always do love doing eye makeup but i feel like as i'm growing up i'm i don't want to say this because it actually breaks my heart because makeup is something i've loved doing my whole life i've never wanted to do makeup as a career well we're sick when i was like eight and nine i've always wanted to do fashion anyway i feel like as i'm getting older i'm a lot more getting out of doing makeup and getting more into fashion and lifestyle and stuff like that i don't know what it is i just can't explain it it's just i can't keep doing something that i don't love i don't want to just do loads and loads of makeup posts on instagram like eye makeup posts if i don't love it because this is meant to be my instagram my channel i'd still do tutorials i like doing tutorials um but um i don't know i don't know what it is like eye makeup i haven't posted an eye makeup picture on instagram in 
literally over a month now and that is a long time for me and it is because I just I don't have the time as well like I really do not have the time you wouldn't think I'm 13 okay I go to school and I actually have a job this is my job and obviously I don't need it because I don't have like bills to pay stuff like that as adults have to do all that stuff I'm not an adult luckily and um, I am very busy all the damn time I don't have time to sit down and make eye makeup pictures like do eye makeup on myself I'm constantly I just snorted a little bit I just did it <laughs> what the heck but the pig I don't have the time to create stuff all the time I'm either filming videos doing emails well actually I've stopped replying to my emails now my mum's replying to them because I just can't deal with them and I'm constantly busy with anything everything and I just can't fit that into my into my t schedule and if I did love it so so much still I would manage to fit it in my schedule but obviously I don't love it as much as I used to and also like comparing myself with other people I know you should never compare yourself I never compare myself to the way I look now but you will always have you will just have to you will always compare yourself a little bit you're always gonna think oh, that person's better than me but that obviously always is gonna be there's always gonna be a person better that makeup than you always gonna be a person worse makeup than you same with there's always gonna be a, per, a person with a better eye color than you or people with better worse eye colors you're always gonna you're never gonna be the top of something and you're never ever gonna be the bottom of something so you should never compare yourself but i did start comparing myself a little bit i was just thinking like I don't know if I'm doing this anymore but that wasn't really the main reason at all so I don't want comments like oh you're so good please don't comment that at all if anyone comments that it would just be deleted because I do not want attention at all I do I just want to do this video to maybe inspire other people to feel confident in themselves like please don't give me attention in the comments like your makeup's so good I'm literally begging and now people are going to think I've said that to get comments I swear I literally do not want your comments saying that at all I, w I just want maybe your comments about you and how you feel when you're wearing makeup and stuff like that and I like makeup can change you. You can do makeup in certain ways. One way is to embrace your natural looks. That's how I do my makeup now. And people don't like it for some reason. That's how I do my makeup now. I embrace my naturalness, but also still look like myself. A lot of people do makeup and they look like a completely different person. A completely different person. They contour the crap out of their nose, their hair. They change themselves so so much with makeup. And it's scary, it's like you've had a nose job or like a plastic surgery and it, sh it actually worries me a little bit. But yeah, basically that's my like second point. Hey, stop, why did I do Hey, now I'm going to address hate comments. Obviously I did not stop wearing makeup because of hate comments, I'm not that kind of person. If, I, if that was why I would have stopped wearing makeup years ago, I've been getting hate from people in real life about my makeup from literally since I was younger. So it's, that's not the reason why I start wearing makeup. The other two kind of were the first one mainly. Um, this is more addressing... This is actually quite funny what I'm going to be talking about. Yeah, hate comments. They're not funny. But the way I'm going to be saying it is quite funny because it's the most truest thing and it's sad. But it's also bloody hilarious. Okay. Eyebrows. If you go follow me on Instagram, smakeup underscore, you will know my... You will know my eyebrow situation I've been going through, my rants and my story. And I'm going to do this because this is stressing me out. One thing I want to say, since when did people become so concerned over me not filling in my eyebrows anymore? Honestly, I don't think, right, let's do some example. I love, let's say, Sophie does nails, okay? She does her eyebrows, most people do, they do makeup. If she stopped filling in her eyebrows, I genuinely, I mean, I would notice, obviously, I genuinely can't imagine myself taking the time out of the day to literally come in it's so weird that you don't fill in your eyebrows anymore that's really weird you should fill them in and like everyone not everyone but so many people are blue in fight like commented on it i literally cannot imagine if i so like anyone anyone i just can't imagine commenting like why are you not filling your eyebrows anymore that's just it's weird it's like why do you not wear trainers anymore it's just like because i don't want to like I, I just don't want to for one reason or another and the funny thing is about this I know I keep saying funny, but this is, is quite funny. I am getting so much hate for not filling my eyebrows. It's weird, okay? People are commenting on my Instagram pictures, you should fill in your eyebrows, they look bad without it. I hate your eyebrows when you don't fill them in, okay? So, if, I do, if, I, if I'm wrong or if I'm right, I thought, you know what I'm going to do? 
I'm going to look through and see if there was any hate when I used to fill them in because I knew, I knew there was but I, I was thinking maybe it wasn't that much though, maybe it was only a few people okay so I actually get emails to my inbox when I get a comment so like from YouTube they just send you an email when you get a comment so I typed in eyebrows into my email bar the shy I used to get for my eyebrows when I used to fill them in is literally insane genuinely insane I'm going to insert some on the screen right now because you all are going to be laughing you're going to be laughing your head off it's laughing I know but change the accent you're going to be so it's just so funny do you know why you can't please everyone okay I'm getting hate when I fill my eyebrows in I'm getting hate when I don't fill my eyebrows in and if I shaved off my eyebrows I'd still get hate you're going to get hate anyway there's literally no point of doing you can't you can't change yourself and do what other people want because if I did go by that I don't oh, by the way I didn't stop filling my eyebrows because of the hate comments I just stopped filling them in because I prefer my natural brows that's just my own opinion now you're gonna get hate either way I don't feel if I if I did listen to hate comments okay so they're all telling me this oh your eyebrows are rubbish you when you fill them in they're horrible and then these next comments are the ones I'm getting now when I don't fill them in <laughs> And I'll be like, oh no, oh god no, like, I don't want them to think that, so I stop filling them in. And then I get the whole other people saying, uh, filling your eyebrows, your eyebrows need to be filled in, they're too thin, they're disgusting. What am I going to do then? Then I'll start filling them in again, get all that hate back, do it again. It's just like a, a blooming boomerang, isn't it? It's just like, you're just going to get hate no matter what you do, so just do what you want. Just friggin, I'm not going to swear, friggin do what you want, okay? Because you're just going to get hate no matter what. It's like when people say to me, oh, I don't know whether to do this because I'm going to get judged. You're going to get judged anyway. Everything you're going to do in life, you're going to be judged. Admit it. Think to yourself now, have you ever judged someone? Yes, you have. It's human. People judge you. You you judge people. You just, you always are going to be, you're always going to be judged no matter what you do. There's no point of not doing it because you're going to get judged because you're going to get judged anyway. If you don't do it, you're going to get judged. If you do do it, you're going to get judged. There's no way. So just blim and do what you want. Just don't try and please everyone. This has gone from a very big tangent, but I thought I'd just do it to explain why and explain my rants and angers. Basically, yeah. So I really hope this hasn't come across in the wrong way. I wanted to maybe inspire some people. Please comment down below your opinions on makeup please no one comment about my eyebrows and be like i think maybe if you just line them a bit i don't care i don't want to fit i don't want to line them i don't want to line them a little bit i want to leave them like this i like them like this yes i know they need waxing but i'm growing them out so yeah <laughs> the video finally um i just oh I, I wanted to do this i just had to do it there's been too many questions obviously i'm not going to stop doing makeup i probably will not be doing any more eye makeup on instagram that is just where i want to go with it. i want to be have more of a me instagram and fashion my youtube i will obviously still be doing makeup videos all the time it's not what i'm saying um i will still be doing some tutorials i have done some in like the last week so that's not what i'm saying but yeah and i just want to say this and i love you so 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 much and please don't feel even feel bad for wearing makeup at all i don't want that to come across in that way because you're all so gorgeous and you're all gorgeous with and without makeup so please remember that don't think oh god i don't want to wear makeup now because summer doesn't want me to obviously you can this is just my own personal experience and i literally love you all so much thank you bye